That was her very last picture. John and May Lee and Lynn's home is a tribute to their daughter Jenny, a straight A student, a budding musician, at 14 years old, frozen in time. She gave us coupon one year. This is worth five hugs. On May 27, 1994, John left work and came to his home in Castro Valley's Palomares Hills to discover a stranger had been there. He found Jenny bound and stabbed to death in the bathroom. It was just so devastating um, and just taking everyone in shock. It's been 23 years since it happened. Since then, the Lens have moved just outside of Los Angeles. But because their daughter's killer is still out there, they've never really moved on. Finding the person who is responsible for my daughter's killing remains the most important thing. Over the years, there have been leads, but no arrests. Authorities think the killer figured out the family's pattern and broke into their home through a small downstairs window. For years, there's been a hefty reward for information leading to an arrest, but the Alameda County Sheriff's Department is now focused on new technology. The FBI released this 3D model of the Lynn home a couple of weeks ago, and they're hoping to use social media to draw attention to the case. And what we're doing is we're taking uh, the most current technology to uh, reevaluate the evidence that has been collected 20 years ago. The Lens still believe there will be justice for Jenny. We remain very hopeful that uh, the case will be solved. Though they say nothing will heal this 23-year-old wound. A closure doesn't mean the end of uh, pain, the end of sadness. That would stay with us all the way. But at least it's an answer that we've been looking for. Kristen Ayers, KPIX 5.